we start with one hour chart. Okay, feel free to analyze analysis. We mentioned if we get a correction, we can look for buy, and this is what we get. And we mentioned that if we don't have a correction in case the price sharply move, we suggest to have entry above the stop. Now we want to see how we can trade it because now we have this correction. Okay, because we have been looking for this in relative to what we had here. Okay, the thing is whether this is a correction for the continuation to break this top or the price can take the top and reverse. Okay, by the way, we want to see whether we can get the buy and how deep this one can go. All right, if drop a bit more, it can give us a better trade setup in terms of the risk and reward. Okay, and based on daily chart, we have nothing to talk. And if we move to forward chart, First of all, based on forward chart, we have been looking for this correction in relative to this. Now we see this, the, the way is correcting. We can, if we get any buy setup we are looking for, all right? But we, we should know that it's still, we, what we are looking for, the price to break this top and continue. But we need to be aware that the price is leak and take and reverse, okay? Because we're looking for the bigger correction. In case this one turned to a bigger correction for one more drop, okay? By the way, what I want to, what I'm mentioning is that if we get any buy from here, as long as the price come to this top, we see there is no continuation or it's moving as a really corrective. The move is corrective move. We don't stay with the trade. This is the only things I need to mention here. And now we want to see how we can trade it. Okay, if we move to one hour chart, this is what we're looking for. All right. If this one is become a deeper, it's better for us because between one hour or 15 minutes, we can look for sharp move like to take the trade. But how about if the price sharply move from here, we can have entry above the stop. May we put above here, all right? But again, we put here. But again, what we want when we want an entry above the top, we want the price tag break and continue. If the price tag is not moving, we take out the trade because we mentioned easily the price can come to somewhere near to this. It doesn't matter. I mean, we don't need to wait to break out. The price uh, easily can comes somewhere around this top, then reverse. That's why if we want to have a trip of this, what we want the price tag and continue with tag within bar or two hours if we see it's not moving, we don't stay with the trade. And if this one turned to a deeper correction, then having a trip of this is not valid. Maybe we need to adjust it because at that time we can have a trade set up within this range. And if this one turned to a move very corrective, we are not going to have a trip of this. By the way, the best things we want to see, we want to see if we get, we can get any buy setup from the correction rather than having a trip of the stop. Okay. In this case, we just follow the chart. We see whether we can get any buy setup and we're expecting the price to break this stop. But by the way, again, the price come to this, uh, I mean, near to the top of, or even break the top. If it is not moving, it's really, is turned to a corrective move. We take out the trade. Anyway, we just follow the chart. We see whether we can get any trade setup or not. Thanks.